film my high level of guillotine and breakdown of it. So I'm going to start from standing just so that you guys get the mechanics because it's slightly different than your normal guillotine. And then I'm going to bring it down to the ground where I finished it. But I'll give you guys some options of where I would rather do it because where I finished it isn't my preference, but obviously it works. Okay. So when we start, I'm going to grab a round on this chin. A lot of times people grab back here. That's not good on your grip. You want to grab over here. And then when I grab my hand, you're not going to grab wrist. For a normal guillotine, a lot of people grab wrist which is great because you don't want that articulation in a regular guillotine. For our marcellotine or our high elbow, we want to grab down further on the hands because you want that wrist articulation right here. Okay, so I'm grabbing the chin. I'm going to come grab that hand. And as I do this, I'm not just going to bring this up because then I'm just pulling up on that neck. Okay, and that's hurting my shoulders. And you look like a silly because you've defeated the whole purpose of the high elbow, okay? So as I do this, I want to turn this hip right here and do it to get our finish. Okay, now obviously it's from standing. They could spin out of it, yada, yada. But... One more time, I'm gonna go through, grabbing that chin right here, and I'll even come when I do this chin strap, and I grab on those teeth here. Okay, because you've got a, a purchase. You got a nice little ledge there. Come through, I grab those fingers, and then I'm just gonna twist this hip right here, and do it to finish. And then as I do this, this far elbow, I'm gonna tuck it, okay? So then we're gonna bring it to the ground so you guys can see where I finished it from. It whirls here. So basically where I was is I had this hook in here because I was playing a little bit of butterfly and she was able to push this through. As she did that, she started passing this way though with the head on that side. So I just grabbed my guillotine, grabbed my hands, and I pinched right down here with my feet so she wasn't able to jump through. So otherwise, if this is loose, you're gonna have to stomp on that calf and it's gonna be a lot more work. It'll still work, but if I can lock right here, this is better. So then you're just gonna grab the hands as she goes through, that high elbow just comes up, and then we're just gonna finish it, okay? So all it is, is I'm sitting here, I'm playing butterfly. She smashes this to the side. I'm gonna pull this out. I grab that foot and I'm punching that head to the side as I grab it, lock in those feet, grab the hand, and then twist as that elbow comes up. And it should be a pretty easy finish. You're sitting there struggling for it. You need to find the right angle.